Hello my soccer universe, welcome to another unpacking video and yeah we're gonna wrap up now all uh, the La Liga stuff in a way. Uh, La Liga jersey review you saw the last part, I will post today a uh, poll on which of the sets you liked best overall. And to wrap it all up I have here a parcel with another La Liga team that I didn't have so far. I'm also wearing a La Liga team, black, yeah yeah it's very black. Fits to the to the day. Milan, who is currently watching and deciding not to score anymore, is also wearing all black, so it all fits to a black day. Let's open this bad boy up. This is of course second hand from a. Uh, I found a very nice. I, I found this uh, on this uh, page. Will Haben, and turns out it's also from a fellow connector. We connected, of course. Uh, he is living close by, but not close enough so that I could drive there because not really getting out there uh, unfortunately too often now especially with the lockdown it's even more work but uh, his name is Oliver he has a really nice Instagram account um, posting his uh, link there please subscribe to him he has, a, he has an awesome collection uh, all uh, with name sets and so on and so he put up this one for sale it's a in a way very special jersey I have to say and of course for a team that I don't have yet and spoiler alert it will also be a team that I prob will probably only last for this season but let's see I really hope they stay in last hint before I let you guess uh, it's also a team that played in one European Cup final some time ago so yeah here you can guess it. I'm gonna pull it out now. I'm gonna do it a little bit like Dan from Club Football Shirts because <laughs> it is red. Which team can be red? I show you the back. It has number 77 which is my birth year so that's already a good one. This was the only thing uh, that I was told is a little bit damaged and yes it's a teeny bit but it's not too bad. You can already see the crest here. Let's turn it around. This shirt it is Real Mallorca and I think this is from the 1718 season uh, pretty nice shirt I gotta say and given how I did not like uh, the Real Mallorca shirts as, as of later let me close the color here I was actually when I saw this I thought immediately that looks different that looks nice that looks interesting with the little black up top I really really like it now this is in so far also an interesting jersey because this is the only time that Real Mallorca played in the third division uh, in Spain and they promptly uh, gained promotion. So I mean and that then took them all the way up to La Liga, down again, up again and so on. So in a way it's the low point but it's also the start of a new campaign, uh, a, a new time for um, Mallorca. Now I like that, I mean, yes, it's, it's a betting sponsor, but you know, uh, with the Baleares, so there's a little bit some local stuff here. Um, uh, Toto Una Vida, there is some coordinates in here, which I assume are of the stadium. Uh, and then of course, OK Cars, which is probably a taxi stuff. So I have to say, and then there is of course on the back Air Europa which I think is also uh, current uh, uh, an Balearic airline, but I'm not 100% of that. The one thing with Real Mallorca, and if you have any insight on that, what I never understood is, what does this crest actually mean? The letters here, I mean, I can make out maybe an F here. I can make out a C here. Maybe with this here, I don't know, maybe there's an M somewhat there, but it's really, 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 really weird. This is one of those crests that always have me scratching my head. But yeah, I have Real Mallorca. I actually thought when I bought it, <laughs> this is not my first island team. Of course, uh, British islands, no. And then, yeah, I have Cagliari. It's not my first island team, but it's my first... Iberian island team and for that it's pretty pretty cool. I actually wish that we go back to a, to a time when there were more island teams 
on there. Uh, Oliver actually has a lot of Tenerife shirts. I think he's a fan of those. So, and I have to say, I, I, I would love it if Tenerife uh, would come up again. But yeah, I actually, I really like this shirt. Uh, and it will now be hanging back up there uh, on the background. Maybe sometimes I'll be wearing it if Mallorca is doing well. So, I'm, as I said, I'm very pleased in getting this one. In any case, let me know what you think about this shirt. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. I unfortunately will... I don't know. I, the next um, jersey review will be Serie A, but I don't know when I will find the time to shoot it. I'm not sure if I will get to it this weekend, but hey, let's see. But in any case, I will talk to you soon. At least I will show you some shirts and we'll talk about the actions in the leagues. Bye! I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated on all the things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day. Bye.